So I'm really excited for today's video because I will be playing a Zelda game that I bet some of you have never seen before, and that is Cadence of Hyrule. Cadence of Hyrule is both a spin-off of The Legend of Zelda and an amazing rhythm game called Crypt of the Necrodancer. And yeah, you heard that right. This is a Zelda rhythm game, but don't let that throw you off because this game is so fun. I actually played this game when it first came out, as you can see with by all my save files here. But what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be starting a new game. And as you can see, we have a couple options here that we can choose from. Dungeon mode. This is what I am going to be playing today. And what it does is replace the overworld with a single large dungeon for players looking for the classic Necro Dancer experience. I've tried this one out and it is really fun. I've also played Crypt of the Necro Dancer, which is a really fun game. Really hard, by the way. This game is actually pretty hard. I'm not going to lie. So if I don't perform that well today, then uh, hey, I warned you. <laughs> We can choose our character here. There's a couple of them. We know we're going to go with the classic Link here, of course. All right, we've got our settings. I am so excited to show y'all this game, either for the first time or just to remind you that this game exists and maybe you can go back and play it for yourself because it is, it is such an amazing game. But let's go. All right, and here we are, man. I've got to say, the graphics of this game are so good. They remind me a lot of A Link to the Past, but kind of modernized. It's really nice. We could take our small shield here. It automatically assigns to R and only that's Link and Cadence can use it. And I'm not going to lie. I am so bad at using the shield. I will probably never use it. I just forget every time. <laughs> but we get to choose a, a thing to take with us. And I think, honestly, I've played this dungeon mode before. And I found that the bombs are pretty nice to take. Because there are some enemies that you need to have bombs to defeat. And I'm spawning in with absolutely nothing in my inventory other than the things that I just took. So yeah, this is going to be a little tough. Hopefully we can make it though. All right. And here we go. So as you can see, if you're not aware of how this game works there's this little metronome thing at the bottom there and you have to move to the beat of the song and by the way the song yeah it's really good the music the soundtrack in this game is all remixed songs from the legend of zelda series and it is so good oh my god i'm i'm really nervous though okay i've got to get my head in the game here because i just do not know what i'm doing it's been so long since i've played this game i'm super nervous but honestly i'm just so excited the thing that got me back into playing this game was I've actually started playing uh, Crypt of the Necrodancer, which is the original version of this game. And it kind of reminded me of uh, Cadence of Hyrule, which is, uh, I played that game first because, you know, it's a Zelda game. I've got to play all the Zelda games. I'm super glad it reminded me of this game because I'm having a blast playing this game again. Hey, we got yeah. Navi here. I don't know if that's Navi. It's just a fairy. Hey, look, a shrine. Shrines are useful, but they often have a tricky side effect that you may not like. Bump into it if you want to take a chance and activate the shrine. Okay, shrine effect stay active until you leave the dungeon defeat the dungeon boss or are defeated uh-oh so we have two to choose from oh god it doesn't say oh lord encrypted the necro dancer it kind of says what it does i do not know this one looks nicer though so we're gonna <laughs> god, this could be death here and might i say it is really hard to keep beat while <laughs> commentating oh god okay let's do this i got this i got this i got this this can get us some good money too which we need for shops but i just gotta focus on staying on beat and not getting hit. Oh, it, it's over. No, <laughs> no, come on. I already died, dude. I got trapped, dude. That's so embarrassing. Oh my God. Well, we've got to try again. Oh, and this is where you go after you die. And yeah, you can buy something to take into your next run. But God, that was so embarrassing. Let's try that again. Maybe I should not have done the shrines. Okay, well, we got something here. Ignore ice, wait up. I don't really know what wait up does. My God, it's so hard to keep beat while commentating, man. <laughs> oh, here we go. So this is somewhere I'll have to use my bombs because I won't be able to, uh, maybe I will, Never mind. Scroll of need. Oh, okay. I thought that it wouldn't let me go in there. Oh, is that because of the, oh, it's because of the boots that I just picked up. It ignored, what did it say? It ignores traps. Oh, okay. Oh God. I'm, dude, I'm in a bad situation here. <laughs> God, it's so hard to keep beat. I gotta get better at keeping the beat while commentating. Oh God, see? Ah! I got this guy throwing bombs at me. Got whiz robes, dude. Jesus, dude, this is insane. Oh, look. Piece of heart, there we go, we'll take that. And I think that'll actually save. So yeah, we should have two now. Okay, let's start start taking out the boss. Unfortunately, his own, his own bombs don't hurt him. That would be great if they did. Oh, dang, dude. Okay. These bat I can't. Oh, there we go. Nice. It killed the bat. Yes. Okay, that's the first. Okay, let's uh, let's use this scroll of need. I want to see what it. What does the game think we need right now? A ring. What did we just get? Ring of courage. Dash into an enemy space when you defeat them, preventing damage to yourself. See, 
A lot of these things, <laughs> I'm probably just not going to remember, honestly. Oh no, it automatically does it. Okay, okay, well then that works perfectly. Look at, oh, it literally just worked like that. Wow, I would have taken damage if I didn't have the ring, nice. Okay, here we go. We've entered the shop. Look, I love this guy so much. He sings, his singing is so good. He like sings to the soundtrack. But yeah, you can buy stuff with your rupees here. I oh, mean, I would love to have enough to get this wide attack here. One thing that I actually figured out when testing this dungeon mode out is that you can drop a bomb near these shopkeepers and uh, they'll attack you. They're really strong, but if you kill them, you can take all the stuff from the store for free. But there's a chance that like the other shopkeepers that you find will be mad at you and they'll freaking just, they'll just like instantly kill you. So so I'm not going to do it. I don't want to risk my uh, chances here of beating this. Ooh, look, found a fairy fountain. Ah, oh, man, it would be so great if I had a bottle, but maybe we'll find one later. We can come back here and get a fairy. These guys right here are kind of tough because you have to, you can only hit them from behind. There we go. What's this? Oh God, do I really want to do this? Oh Lord, what am I doing? Let's see. Okay. Ooh, no. Oh, okay. Oh no, this is not good. Am I trapped? Am I trapped here? Okay, I gotta get out of this this spot. Oh, okay. What am I doing? Oh my god. It seems so easy, but then you just like... I don't know. It's like I get... It. See? Dang it, man. It seems so easy and so doable, but I get into this like false sense of security and I'm like, I got this. And then I just like, in, I die so quickly, man. Dang it. We have two diamonds. Let's get this heart container. I'm definitely going to need it. Oh, look, I just got a glass spear. The glass weapons are so scary because they, they can be really good. But if you get hit, it uh, it gets destroyed. So I'm going to try and make some good use out of this because the spears are actually really good. Oh, my God. I'm missing my beats, man. Nice. Look at that. Look how fast we just killed that boss, man. Holy crap. If we can get a scroll here that freezes enemies. Yeah, we're definitely going to want that. Oh, look, look at this. We have a locked chest here. I think I actually have a key. I think last time I died, I picked up a key. Yeah, Tingle's Dowser. What is that? I feel like I remember this from the main story, but I don't remember what it does. Using this in the Lost Woods will help you find your way through. Using it elsewhere may lead to... Oh, may lead to... I was like, dude, did they just give me a useless item? Okay, so using it elsewhere helps me find treasure. I, I don't... I don't know how that works. All right, we've made it to the zone two boss. Oh God, what is that? I, I do not know what that is. Okay. Oh, dude, the spear is amazing, man. I never want to lose this glass spear unless I find another spear. Dude, it is so good. Okay, I got a scroll of need again though. So let's see what, it gave me a ring. Nehru's ring reflects damage when done to you from any enemy. One use only though. Oof. I mean, that's pretty, it's pretty, it's pretty good, but it's only one use. Oh, all right. Floor 1-3, dude. Listen to this freaking soundtrack, man. It is, oh my, it's so good, dude. That's one thing about this. Like, I wish that they, that Nintendo put their soundtracks on Spotify because, man, I would totally just like have this in a video game soundtrack. It is so good. <laughs> all right, so there's a chest right here, but there's some little teeth. I, I wonder if I could take this out with my bombs. Let's see. Yeah, nice. Okay. Gotta watch out for the skull tool, though. Piece of heart. Ooh. Nice, dude. We just collected a heart container. Let's go. Five hearts. Listen to that. Soundtrack. So good. Ooh, I just deflected damage. Okay, I don't even know what that was from, but thank God I had the ring because my spear would have broke. There's the boss right there, actually. Oh, okay. <laughs> Did my weapon break? <gasps> no! Ooh, it's over. No. I thought it would have been fine. I thought I was going to hit that wooden thing right there. What the heck? Oh my god, what am I do What? Now I have no torch. It's over, bro. What 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 have I done? This just got really bad. Or maybe maybe I'm thinking about it too much. Oh god, what? I don't do too damage anymore now. <laughs> oh god, I'm almost dead. What is that, bro? Oh my god, it's moving with me. This is terrible. No! Oh god. No! <laughs> hey, I think you've watched quite a good bit of this video, so that must mean you're enjoying it, right? If you are enjoying it, then please consider subscribing to the channel. It would really mean a lot, and it would make me very happy. Also, uh, if you want to see more content from me and chat with me live, check out my Twitch, because I've actually been streaming quite a bit over there. So if you're interested in that, then check me out on Twitch at twitch.tv slash Cronus Vibes. I'd love to see y'all there. Let's get back into absolutely sucking at this game. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha.
Whoa, I got a bow. Oh my god, I wasn't even talking during that, so I can't even show it all. But I just completed one of these things. I was sure I was going to die, but I actually completed it. And I got a bow. Nice. Ooh, I just got a torch that gives me max vision, but it uses stamina. That's pretty nice. Oh, whoa, I can, like, see everything in the chest. Okay, let's get this weapon. I think it's a glass weapon, but you know what? Glass short sword, okay. You know what, it's better than nothing. Or it's better than the normal short sword. And we'll get our normal short sword if we uh, break the glass weapon. We'll see, two damage, at plus two damage after dig. I swear, I I'm never going to use that. Oh my god. Was that a floor master? Oh, here's the boss. Oh, he just got teleported. Oh god, it's back! I was not paying attention. Ah! No, my weapon was shattered. Oh, oh, what's up, bro? Thank God that I have uh, five. I have six now, bro. Nice. So we can take 0.5 hearts to get this bottle. And I think that it's worth it. Because now if we find fairies, I'll be able to keep one. Oh, God, there's the boss. Jesus, dude. Can I get this with my bow, perhaps? Oh, God. Hey, come back. Get over here. They're getting confused. Oh, I think you gotta like chip down the armor. Oh god, dude, what am I doing? Is he is he trapped? Can I just? He's trapped. I'm scared though. What if I like go forward? He kills me. I'm just gonna keep dropping bombs, dude, because I do not want to risk it. <laughs> oh look at that, dude! <laughs> Another bottle. I'll take it. You know what? I'll take that. Two bottles, and I'll take the temporary damage boost. We can use that for like a boss or something. Oh shoot! Oh, wait, we actually made it through zone one. Well, not quite. We still have the boss. Let me equip my scroll of enchant weapon. I, I really wish I had a different weapon other than the base short sword. I'm going to try and beat this boss. I feel like we have some pretty good scrolls. Like we can use this scroll of enchant weapon and the scroll of freezing. I'm wondering if you can use it on a boss. That would honestly be really helpful if I could use that. All right, let's give it a shot. Oh. It's Octavio. Greetings, holder of the Triforce. My name is Oc Octavo. Oh, I thought it was Octavio. My bad, bro. And Hyrule belongs to me, at least for now. If you don't like it, see if you can stop me. First, you'll need to prove your worth by collecting all four of my magic instruments. Now allow me to introduce the first of my champions. Power of Lightning. Electrify my Glockenspiel's keys. The Glockenspiel. What do we got? Oh, a Glockenspiel. Is that what it is? Gleok and Spiel! <laughs> Dude, that is terrifying. Alright. Okay, wait, let me- Okay, let me- <laughs> Pause. <laughs> let me just prepare myself. How long does this, uh, temporarily increase your damage? How oh, I don't know how long though. Okay, let's just- Freeze! It did not work. Okay. Okay, but let's- Oh my god. Okay. Oh, okay, this is not going well. Enchant weapon. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Okay, 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 we got one head, but, oh my god, this is insane, this is insane. Okay, so we gotta, like, avoid the heads. Okay, nice. This is, like, so much harder to do while commentating. Ugh. Ooh, no, 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 please! Oh, you know what, let me use my bow. Okay, not like that. Let me use my bow. I feel like that could work. It only does one heart, though. Ooh. Okay, I'm out of arrows. Oh, you know what I could use, maybe? Bombs. Yeah, okay. Oh my god. Okay, well, that didn't work. Uh-oh. No! Oh, that was close. You see if I can get this head. Oh, that... Oh, my scroll wore out. Okay, we have one heart. One heart and a dream bit. No! Oh, come on. Dang it, dude. That is terrible. I'm so sad. Oh, shoot. We respawn here. Wait. Oh, but I respawn with nothing, though. So that's kind of... Okay, let me try this one more time with nothing. And then if I can't beat it, then I'm going to go back to zone one and try and collect a whole bunch of stuff. And then I'll try it for the last time and hopefully beat it. But hopefully... Maybe we can beat it right here. Who knows? It's all patterns, you know? You just got to... Memorize the patterns. Okay, don't stand in the water. That's stupid. Everybody knows water and electricity don't mix well. Okay, one head down. Or, well, almost. There we go. Look at that. Yes. It's good to get, like, right next to the heads while they're doing their stun attack. I, that's what I figured out. Oh, God. Now the body's moving. Uh-oh. What, what is happening? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, dang it. Wait, honestly. Ooh, damage at low. How much is that? Two diamonds? Okay, wait. Maybe I'm gonna try this again. I'm gonna try it again without going back to zone one. I feel like I can do this. 
Okay, never mind. Oh, shoot. Wait, I wasn't going to commentate during this, but I actually just got a long sword. So it deals one damage with two range and we're going to be able to keep that. It's not glass, so it won't break. Okay, this is actually huge because now, I mean, it's as good as a spear, to be honest. The only downside is that it prevents shield use, uh, but I never really use my shield, so it doesn't really matter. That's huge. We could use that against the boss. Speaking of boss, I've made it back and it is time to fight the boss. So we have the scroll of freezing again, which we know doesn't work, but we have a scroll of enchant armor, which will temporarily increase our armor rating by 0.5. So that's nice. I also have a health potion. So this will be used if I, if I run out of hearts, if I die, it'll automatically be used. So that's really nice. And now we have the long sword. So I feel like our chances are better, but this is it fellas. If I die here, then the video ends. If I win, then the video ends, but on a good note. <laughs> So, let's see how it goes. I've got to try my best here. I forgot to use my armor thing. There we go. We use my enchant armor. I'm just going to play this very slowly. Not be too aggressive. Ooh, that was close. Okay, one head down. Ah, I'm taking damage. You could probably get this guy here. Yep. I keep hitting the heads while they're, like, charging up their attack, and then I keep getting stunned. Oh, my God. The soundtrack is so good, though. Okay, here we go. I'm just gonna, let's do this. Oh God, oh God. Oh no, it's okay, we still have our health potion. But let's see. Yes, let's go, dude, we did it. We used our health potion. Oh, thank God for the health potion, man. Yes, I defeated the Gleok and Spiel, let's go. All right, let's get our heart container. We are up to seven hearts now, and let's get the Glock and Spiel. Hey, yeah. Let's go. Oh my god. That was so nerve-wracking, man. Oh, thank god for the health potion, dude. <laughs> thank god for the health potion. You got the glockenspiel. You can feel powerful magic emanating from it when you hold it. Yes! Let's go! And now we're on to zone two. And we can choose one thing to take with us here. I think I'm going to take the great bow. An upgrade on your old bow. This bow fires arrows that pierce enemies, damaging all enemies in a line. Yeah. That's nice. All right, but honestly, I feel like this is a good time to end the video here. If you guys want to see more Cadence of Hyrule, if you guys want to see me like beat this dungeon mode, let me know in the comments below because honestly, I had a ton of fun. It is, It has been so fun playing this game again after so many years. So I would absolutely be down to continue playing this game on the channel if you guys want it. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. If you guys like the video, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.